All right, so we did the right side of the heart. Now we are going to do the left side of the heart once I get my glove back on. Do that, I can't do my phone with my gloves on. That would make life a lot easier. All right, so now we are going to cut open the left side of the heart. And this time you'll notice right away that it's very different. Now we are just like last time, we're going to kind of cut it down the side so we can flap the whole thing open like a book. Oops. And notice right away that it's very different. Look how thick it is compared to the right side. That's like at least a centimeter and a half, maybe even two centimeters. That is some thick muscle. So Remember, the left side of the heart pumps to the whole body. I think you can hypothesize why you might need to have more muscle pumping to the whole body than just to your lungs. And then this is my favorite valve, the mitral valve, and the reason is, is it looks so thin and inconsequential, but it is so amazing and strong. So I want you to put your finger under there and push and try to break it. So push as hard as you can. Then get the strongest person in your group to push as hard as they can. Now I've done this with students for years and occasionally people actually manage to pull the muscle of the wall of the heart out, but actually breaking it just with pressure is pretty much impossible. Now you can slice through it with a razor blade, sure, but if you just try to push against it and break it, it's pretty much impossible. And I find that amazing because it's such a thin little piece of material. You think you could push right through it. But if you think about it, every heartbeat of every day pushes back against this valve. And if the valve broke, your blood would go backwards and you would die. So this little tiny piece of flap is between you and death. And I'm always amazed by it <clears throat> because it just looks so thin, but yet it's so, so strong. And then we have so that is the left side of the heart, and remember it does eventually, kind of behind here, goes out the aorta. There is another valve up there too, but it's not as cool as the mitral valve. And that is the end of our heart dissection. Now you may play with the heart if you would like.